We're coming to you live from Don't Ever Bank Your Field in Croxham Skull, Florida. It's over 110 degrees outside. Man, is it hot. The only difference between this place and an oven is that ovens don't produce serial killers. And yeah, this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The Hexon Oilers take on the Croxham Skull Jugulars. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> if the sound of a torn Achilles followed by laughter and taunting brings a smile to your face, you are tuned to the right place. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow and the NFL crew is coming to you live on game day. Bricks, any uh, thoughts on today's game? Um, I thought I had one, but uh, I think I might have forgotten it. Oh, I remember. Uh, I forgot who's playing today. Careful what you ask for, Grim. No, oh, no, it's a sticky ball dirty trick. And that's a sack. Speaking of sacks, has anybody seen my pop? I've heard of hot streaks, but this guy is literally on fire. It's like one of them video game crazy flame on modes. Second down in a lot. And that's the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. Third down and six. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have... Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. That run is good for nine yards. Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, and he laterals at the last second. Nifty move there. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. Tired of the quarterback's tight spiral. You know, if he was still talking, he'd probably be saying, Psycho killer. Keska say, what the fuck, the fuck, the fuck? And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Uh, if I was that QB, I'd be pissed. QB is saying his prayers. Oh, and he intercepts the ball. Thank you very much, says the defender. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks.
And it's first and ten. And they're picking up chunks of yards now. Nice reception for ten yards. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Third and two. This is your brain. It's oh, now the offense is getting kills. Uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, do, well, maybe actually shouldn't have. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Summers. And it's first and ten. And the ground game is starting to soften up the defense. First down. A man from prison just came out of the field. It's the ref, idiot. Oh. Let's see what the penalty is. <laughs> And it's first and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks, with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwann Galaxy phone. And it's first and ten. You can't keep a good mutant. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. First down and less than a defense says enough of this BS and jumps offside to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. First down and seven. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That the offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. Second down and seven. Man, what a hit that was. Third down and the punter is warming up. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Damn, man, the game's on the now. They almost had 
<laughs> now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? They kick the kicker's job in half? They just be caught straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Good night, Irene. You ever get hit in the face with a shovel, Graham? I have. And trust me, the hit that guy just took was worse. And it's first and ten. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. Oh, man, he just laid the... Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I got to check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And this game is up for grabs. And that'll be second down and four. First down! Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. And it's first and ten. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Oh, man. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. Not much there, maybe a yard. Second down and nine. point with multiple interception if there were any functioning brain cells before that hit they're gone now he's gonna have the iq of a rutabag after that hit and it's first and ten Shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. That's a nice catch for five yards.
Second down and five. And another interception. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. And it's first and ten. The quarterback has had enough and calls a murder ball dirty trick to lay with. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. I don't think you can see that, man. Shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. into the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? And that'll bring up second and one. the ball on that one. And that'll bring up third and one. He broke free and has open field in front of him. Nicely done for a first down. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. Uh, is the game over yet? I gotta go to the vet to have... Oh, uh, come on. That was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. <laughs> First down and one. Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. Oh, what a brutal hit. The offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break. They're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit. Third and two. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! 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 
Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Oh. Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. Ah, oh, pass the popcorn, Grim. Zoom in on his face, then his crotch. I'm going to see if he cries or pisses himself first. <laughs> Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Two minutes left in the half. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. In a fight between King Kong and Godzilla, and that's another turnover for the defense. And he's off to the races. He's at the 10. You gotta love a player who goes down fighting. First and ten. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, there's no QB. Folks, in the NFL, you are allowed to touch the quarterback, just like that. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Second down in a mile. A nice run there for eight yards. Third down and, well, good luck. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. point attempt straight through the uprights the second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room and we take you to halftime brought to you by Monsanto Industries 
We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, we're going to go to a strip tea show. Where we going? Hey, why don't you sell down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby Blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And it's first and ten. And he rumbles for nine on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. And that'll bring up third and one. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. First and four. Second down and six. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay him for the pick six. For this, you just give him a pat on the head and tell him they don't suck. Third down and six. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. First and ten. Second down and long. And the defense goes for the juggler. He was still talking. He'd be saying, Psycho killer, Keska say. What the fuck, 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 fuck. The Crux and Skull Jugulars seem to have run out of people to kill and win this one by forfeit. I should have known they'd know about anatomy. What would they name it all? I didn't think they'd actually pull the other guys apart and demonstrate it, though. This was practically a science show. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. How was it? Scrambles tomato soup. Wounds. Uh-uh, good. The MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Yeah, right.
right. Putting three words together for this guy is like you doing a Rubik's Cube. What's a Rubik's Cube? Moving on. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Hard Corporation. They get it right every other...